What is up YouTube, Lazy Llama here, and here we are back with some Venture Capitalist playing the event. Uh, haven't really done much with the event. I uh, haven't been on since I played last. I've uh, been really busy today, haven't really had a chance to get on. I think all those are okay to buy. I do gotta be careful what I buy here though. Very careful. So 10 Ninja Turtles is giving us Super King boost. So getting you up is... Okay. He was this. And getting this declines that. Unless we can get it up past about ba -ba -ba -ba, 150, which. Wait, past 150? That was it? 150. So he hurts, he hurts him again, but boosts himself. He hurts him there, boosts him, and hurts him might be worth or is it worth getting the other guy he just straight boosts himself but doesn't hurt himself until the next one uh, and the next one's 200 he just keeps hurting him hurting the other guy like oh no 200 he's okay so you just yeah, fuck it. That's just gonna make him not do much, but this dude does way better anyways. So we have there, you can see that went down. And if we go up to 150, it should go down again over here, but go up drastically over here. So he's actually paying out really well. He's actually moving the number pretty pretty decent. Uh, 10 of these guys. Oop. This, this event's like, you have to think so much. Honey Badger, he is Honey Badger, so it gives him five times. Boom. Easy. Easy peasy. Let's go back to Max. So we can do a lot. Again, I don't see a need to get him. Oh. That sucks. So it ruins the speed of things. It gives profit times 10. So you're ruining the speed by a bit. It's got to be worth it, though. So everything slows down, but the profits go up drastically. Like, look at. That's such a hard debate. And what that's good in. Like. Acceptable till. I don't know like which side I should be looking at. These guys seem all faster than their counterparts. They all are. I don't know if that's necessarily better. So we look at like Batman for example. <laughs> I said Batman. Uh, Batman for example, he ruins him here and then gives himself the black the Black Knight gives a nine times boost for cutting the other dude in half. I don't know which one I should. I think you can choose which side. I think the whole idea is like choose which side you're on. So I think I'm gonna work to buff these guys. Which I don't know if this is the best bet. But I can technically get him the 40. So why not do that? This is gonna gonna cut him in half and he's paying out less, so it's okay. Cut him down more and then boost him up and get an insane boost over here. And then he ruins him again. Alright. I think we're getting this. I think we're getting this. So this dude just straight up buffs. So getting him to 20 is beneficial. 10 of everything is a thing. And ruins speed, but gives... That's ah, so debatable. I think he kind of need it for the 10 times profit. You just have to wait longer to get the money. So he hurts Magneto... Or is that a buff, actually? Oh, that is hurt. Yeah. Huh. Man, this game really gets you, like, thinking. We can, again, level up Spidey. What are they called? Rope Slinger? It hurts him there, and then at 24, he gets a huge boost. He already pays out a lot, but again, we can get him to 24. Let's take the hit. Go with that. And then, boom, boom, for an insane boost. Wow. That's billions. That's gonna, wow. Damn, I really don't have too much on the play. <laughs> I don't want to extend this video on too long. Can you play with just your half? Like half your guys? You have to play on both sides. I'm curious. Is it worth the flop back and forth? Or should I just focus on one side? There's an upgrade on him. Times five profit. Millions. That's not bad, but... Um... We get him up to 77. 
or 76 technically. Oop. Without hurting him, although he's paying out more anyways, but can we get him to the next one? Are we within 80 of it, because if so, I'll, I'll side with them. Beauty of the honey badger, and then yeah, we're within 80. It times himself by two. I almost don't see a reason not to. And he was more affordable. It's not really much. It's not really much pay at all, actually. Uh, 75, we hurt him there. But at 100, actually, he booted, boost himself. Maybe we shouldn't have done that. Okay, I feel like you're just really trying to focus on one side and playing this completely one-sided. But I really don't know. 200, just a straight boost to himself. Career, we got cool career achievement thing. Uh, these videos might be, like I said, closer to 20 minutes just while this is going, this like events going on. Just so you guys know, 20 or yeah, up to 20 there. Honey badger. Um, they're all hurting at this point on this side. The green at 10, he hurts the slinger, but does he benefit? He gives himself 25. See, I really think it's like... I don't know. It's so hard to say. We'll get him up to... Oop. Up to that. I almost went again. Then I would have had to commit. Almost like just stick to a side. Until like later on. And then just boost them both up. I don't know. We can get him up. It'll hurt the profits of... Uh, Super King, but... You get him to that. Oh, it's only four times. Dude, it's so difficult to make decisions. I think you just want to stick with one side, though. I think that's the whole idea. So getting up, him up to 100, I think, is going to be beneficial. Even though we already kind of leveled up the other guy. Yeah, let's just do it. Oop. I want to see how much was in there. And then he's still debatable. And obviously you don't want to necessarily go to it till you can you're like profiting overall. I mean he's gonna pay out so much over the whole going away thing. At 60 he hurts him. And then at 80 he boosts himself. So not to basically we can get about 20 levels, it's not or sorry. 60 and then 8, so 40 levels. Yeah, it's literally double his level. Is it always gonna be like that? Now he hurts there and boosts there. Yeah, we're just gonna focus on one side then. I think that's all this is a matter of doing. We can get him up to technically 25. So we can boost him up so much. But again, we're already hurting back and forth, so it just makes sense to focus one side. That, that's literally the only way it makes sense to play this. If I'm thinking, and then maybe maybe him for the hurt everyone kind of boost profits bullshit. Although, these guys seem to be like slow, but higher profits in general. And these guys are faster, but slightly lower profits maybe. I don't know if that's how it's meant to work. But uh, nonetheless... That's how we're going to play this, I think. Uh, starting to get angels. I'm going to cut here. We'll come back. Uh, it'll be a couple hours for me. I don't know if we're going to beat this event. I'm really not trying too hard to beat it. But I just like playing it. I think you guys enjoy just kind of watching some different kind of content with it. Uh, which is cool with me. I mean, I do enjoy playing it. It's just I don't know if I'm going to have the time to sit there and play it. But uh, anyways, yeah, I'll catch you guys on the next clip. Alrighty, so we are back. And you can tell I'm already slacking like crazy. Um... All profits times five. I don't think those dudes are worth doing because we're not boosting them. I'll do them anyways. Cause that's how I am. Do we go to ten for the ten times everything and lower the speed even more? I think so. I think that should be our top priority. Ten times profit sounds amazing. All right. What are we trying to get up levels next? We can get him to ten, which is nine times honey badger, and honey badger is not paying out bad. Not completely like that, but that'll boost them up quite a bit. Uh, we can get Spidey up to his next goal, but he hurts him, and there's no need to do that. 
I don't think I, I'm just curious if you need to actually flop back and forth and keep constantly hurt them or if you literally just stay on one side I think that's not what you do and you do kind of have to level them both that just injures honey badger for him this dude we can probably get up to his next one though what's it a multiply by the four though that's not worth I think this guy up isn't isn't worth he's just crap compared to him I think no matter what we do he's gonna be right Four times that, still nothing. I think we just keep doing what we're doing and just work on one side. I just don't want to hurt the other side if we don't need to. I don't see a reason to. I don't know. I'm probably playing this completely wrong. I hurt him for like no reason I guess <laughs> I have no idea I just I don't see a point that it just it's counterproductive we'll have a him up a bit Spidey pays out a ton and then I guess I'll come back in a bit I, I don't know I'm just kind of confused on what I should be doing do I just keep doing this or should I be leveling this and at the point I upload this is gonna be too late to <laughs> have your guys input anyways he only boosts by three. Wasn't Dark Knight going up more than three? Yeah, way more. I feel like being on that side is much better. Down later in the tree, it gets better. And does Batman get worse? Yeah. It's like they're opposite. Like, he's good. And then... This one, oh, he's also good though. I feel like it could go either way, I suppose. I just don't think you should like hinder and then get the other one up because I could get him to 20, I think, right? Yeah, but is that still worth it? Maybe. All right, so we're making 9 billion over here. We're gonna do this just for experience. 9 billion here, 8 million here. We're gonna get that. Oh, sorry, I, that gave us a 10 times profit. Shit, so I don't even get to compare it. I thought we had 10 of everything already. All right, so we did that. So he's not making 9 billion, he's making insane amount and then we get him up it's hard to say because we did that I still think it's probably worth just doing at least if you can get that one after it so like the Joker one I think we just we'll try on the Joker one that'll explain it so 50 yeah it's a times three but then he hinders him in half so 12 billion Plus pointless numbers that don't matter. Hinder that. Oh, that's just the speed that got hindered. That was pro. Is it all speeds that get hindered? Because if it's just speeds, I don't, I don't care. Is it literally just speeds? Speeds of profit. Speeds of profit. Oh shit! Did I? Oh my god! You guys are probably yelling at me. It is just speeds that get hindered. The whole point of this whole thing is just slowing the game down. I'm gonna get to the point where I'm waiting like 10 hours for something to happen. Like, look at this, two minutes? Ah, shit, I don't know. At one point, it's worth it. We're gonna do that, so that slowed down. And what does it need to go to next? Trying to make it like exact for now while I check this out. And that boost up. But so he does nothing. Like, I don't know if that was worth losing the bit of speed on him to. <laughs> I don't know. I was so confused. We're still so far away from a reset, too. I don't know what we should be resetting at, but this is already going terrible. I don't think there's a, a point to going to the next one unless it. Unless you can get the one after. I think that's all you gotta worry about. Is can you get the one after? If you can't get the one after, there's no point. So like he 30 he hinders him. There's no point to get him to 30. 75 he hinders him. There's no point to get to 75 because not till 100 he doesn't get a boost. Like you just kind of got to look at it like that, I think. So he slows him down at 666. No point to get him to 666 because he doesn't do anything good. So some I knew some of them had two things that would happen. Yeah. 
And he's a slowdown of everything in the game, and he just buffs things on his team, it looks like. Alright. I think I'm getting it. Still don't know exactly at what point things are worth it. But, uh, I think we're getting somewhere. If I can get him up and hinder him, no point. I feel like it's just a matter of just waiting again. I feel like this is a big waiting one. I wish you can make him go faster by clicking him like that, the micromanagers. I know, I'd like to beat another event, but... I don't know, it's kind of weird. I don't know how I feel about it yet. I think I just gotta go away for a while again and come back. Maybe I'll try to get back on in a couple hours and play. I'll probably do a little bit of playing without you guys. Try to get up to the point where we can reset at least. And try to figure this out. But, uh, anyways, hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If so, please smack the like button. As always, I'll catch you guys later. Peace.